good team the last couple of years and uh, kind of come on rival. And, uh, we got down there, we went down there and got a big win last year. And they came here and got a big win last year, so uh, you know, we're, we're gonna have a big game. Our coach talks about how much he need wants to score in here. But what, what can be done at this point now just to try to get that going? Um, we've been working on uh, you know a few new things uh, in practice the last couple of days and continuing to just work on the offense, uh, get some of the new guys, a lot of reps and everything. And hopefully uh, our offense will be much more crisp. You mentioned the new guys, but uh, after the game Sunday, uh, Coach Carmody kind of called out the seniors, saying he was looking for more from you guys. I mean, did you hear about that? And if you didn't, I mean, guess what are your what's your reaction to that? Is that something you guys take personally? Oh, well, you know, absolutely. I mean, uh, as veterans, you know, especially me and Swap, we didn't play that well against Iowa. And it, you know, in order for us to do well, you know, we need to have good games. And so me and Swap both know that, and we're we'll ready to play tomorrow. Here's the third two on Brandon, Brandon Paul, and who's going to take the stop at? Um, I think it's going to be, you know, need to be a team effort. Um, I mean, I think, you know, with, with any good player in the Big Ten and across the country, you know, it's, it's rare that one guy is going to is going to stop a good player like that. You know, you know, one on one, if we went out there right now, you know, he's, he's probably going to you know, beat us. You know, but, you know, all five of us together, you know, working together, I think we'll be able to at least contain him a little bit. At least I hope so. so we'll see what happens. Tomorrow. What was the key to pulling off that upset last year in Champaign? And I mean, is that something you guys are thinking about for this one? Um, I think last year, you know, we just stayed within our offense. Uh, we had a good game plan defensively. Um, I think we executed it well. Um, I think once again this year, the coaches have done a good job with presenting a game plan for us to follow. And as long as we execute that game plan, I think we can have success. How do you keep from getting too down on yourself? I mean, coming off this Iowa loss and just knowing what's ahead right now, these ranked teams, how do you, how do you not get down on yourself right now and keep things light and loose? Well, I think uh, we're always looking to improve, and uh, we know that those games are in the past. You know, there's nothing we can do about them except learn from them. And you know, that's what we've been trying to do, both in the film room and on the court. Um, you know, I think we've corrected some things that we've done wrong, and uh, now we just look forward. We can't worry about you know, what's happened you know, so far this season. What, what goes through your head when you see I, like these Big Ten games, the standings, and just you know the rankings, especially when you see a bunch of teams in the top ten and top twenty-five in this conference? Uh, well, to me, I just look at that and see a lot of opportunities to get big wins. Uh, you know, the Big Ten is obviously a big conference this year. Everybody knows that. And uh, you know, in order for us to make the tournament, we're going to have to beat a lot of quality teams. Uh, you know, so I think we know that, and uh, you know, we just have to come out uh, ready to play each and every game. Thanks, Reggie.